Hi, this is Scott Dillard with the Instructional Technology Department, and we are at RC Hill with Serena Anderson. She's the Executive Secretary here, and uh, we've been asked to discuss uh, Mastery Manager scanning. Uh, there they are, those are the sheets. And uh, she is signed into Mastery Manager, and we're going to get ready here to scan. Um, we're doing this to help um, others out with just. We'll be right back. And yes, this is live, so we're going to take everything. We're just going to, just unedited, we'll just go with it. Uh, just uh, common issues that arise when uh, Serena and the other um, executive secretaries at the building scan and receive the paperwork from the teachers. So with that said, Serena, what do we do? All right. I have my little bubble sheets. They go in upside down on the dinosaur of a scanner that we have here. <laughs> um, I usually disconnect mine every time. Um, so it's already connected, already logged into Mastery Manager. Um, if it doesn't recognize your scanner, sometimes it'll say it's not there. I just shut it off, turn it back on, and then it usually pops up. So we'll hit scan. It's amazing how shutting things off and turning things back on fixes yes, a lot of things. It's the number one tech uh, awesomeness. So right here <laughs> I hit start, and then they come out. Sometimes if you like hit it oh, and stuff gets <laughs> messed up mm -hmm. in there, okay, it will error out, which of course it didn't do this time. Because my teachers are awesome, and the majority of them give me nice clean sheets. Um, what happens when they don't? What do you when do? they don't, a lot of times they have the ones the students fill out, and they're, oh here, one of them messed up. So that would be the error sheet. So once it errors out like that, then I have to look at this part right here to see which sheet it actually was. So then I will find page one, Kindergarten Lunar Dini, and hit OK. And then you'll see the rest of them go through. And then as, after those go through, I'll put my error one back in fix whatever I think the problem might have been, whether it's an unreadable sheet or sometimes it's a scanning bar. Um, the little bar right here, a lot of times they won't go through if the teachers clicked the fit to page, um, so it's a little bit smaller. I usually just kind of hold them together if that's what I think the problem is. Um, at that point, the teacher would either need to reprint or um, and manual it and manually enter it. And where do they print from, or what do they um, print to? Usually ours print either to print shop or to the big copier here. Um, and that's preferable than printing from like a, to a printer or something like that? It doesn't really matter. I don't think where they print from as long as they remember to not check the box that says fit to page. Okay. Um, because that one screws it up completely. So like this one here is missing a student. So this student was not here on that day, so they just leave that one blank, and we scan everybody else's, and then the teacher can physically go in, um, from what I'm told, and just put in that one student's score or answer. And you usually, you don't do that then? The, I don't the do teachers that, do. Okay. unless they're having a problem, and then I'll try. All right. Um, but yeah, the majority of main problems are that they don't print it correctly, and the scanning bar is not in the right location. Um, we've had it to where we were able to um, enlarge the, the size on the printer and make a copy, and it has taken it. So it's possible that that would work if it was too much to refill in, like one of those guys. Um, but a lot of times, like when the students do it, they're a lot more messed up, and they'll like rub on the page with eraser. At that point, they have to reprint that student specifically and then have the student refill it out or fill it out themselves for me to scan. Okay. Well, thank you for, I think that kind of covers everything we were looking at. Um, and I just want to say thank you for your time, uh, Serena. And uh, I think that's it. So right. we appreciate your time. Thanks so much. Yep.